this rider was stopped now unfortunately he crash helmet on his elbow instead of his head that's an expensive mistake 1500 pesos what's wrong with this guy they just gave him a ticket for riding without helmet he rode away without helmet again oh my goodness really my goodness now he's put it on but he's wearing it like a mushroom it's not actually on his head it's just balanced on top right now the team are coordinating with the barangay and what you'll see is that everyone is removing their obstructions they took the team to this street and they said no parking allowed both sides so the team will start issuing tickets the driver of this one didn't want to get their license someone from the barangay said we already told them to move forward because there's a clearing operation they are writing out the ticket and then they will allow the driver to move on the reality is that most residents were already warned move your vehicle there's a clearing operation so now the streets look so good but in an hour or tomorrow it won't look like this so this one here is already going up on the flatbed tow truck and you'll see this vehicle parked on the sidewalk it's now going on the back of the flatbed tow truck the consider it is illegally parked because it obstructs the sidewalk for pedestrians and they just stopped this motorcycle rider here driving in slippers no crash helmet he does have a license so they'll issue the ticket and then advise him to push the motorcycle instead of riding it you'll see a huge truck parked there on the sidewalk and on the corner the towing crew are just connecting to it now and i think the same thing over there there's another truck they made this whole road into their parking lot there's another one over here and then there's the container without the truck head over there so i doubt they can do anything about that one it seems a lot of residents have been complaining about these trucks so they came out and they were very happy to see them towed some of the drivers did turn up which means they can actually sit behind the steering wheel and control the truck while it's being towed away once the towing process has started it's too late to release it if they came earlier it could have just been a ticket and then moved the vehicle apparently they tried to apprehend someone but he refused to stop so they radioed these enforcers up ahead they've managed to stop i haven't been able to see who it is yet if it's a motorcycle or a tricycle okay it's a tricycle violation could be slippers could be the mirror lack of mirror so this is the one according to the driver he didn't stop for enforcers because he's just going nearby when they asked for his license he said he doesn't have one so the towing crew are coming in now and they're impounding the vehicle i guess that's why he didn't want to stop for enforcers the driver is on the phone to someone now trying to prevent his tricycle from being impounded i'm not sure who it is it took a while but the driver finally left his tricycle and it's going on the back of the tow truck very very stubborn didn't want to stop for enforcers said he doesn't have a license and then refusing to comply but eventually it's on the back of the tow truck that's actually more expensive than not wearing a helmet substandard helmet is 3000 pesos slippers 500 pesos believe it or not this rider already has a ticket from the mmda in a different area for a different violation so this is his second time today getting a ticket and they're now looking to issue a ticket to this one obviously fully obstructing the sidewalk in fact here's an example a lady having to walk in the road with her child because the sidewalk is obstructed if the driver doesn't come out in time it will get towed away to clear the sidewalk they're just issuing a ticket to this one now parked on the sidewalk but there is a driver and they're also issuing a ticket to these two obstructing the sidewalk even the road itself they don't exercise rights. Ano yun? Official ang kakausap sa kanila. Nag-atrasa na sila. Diba? Anong sabi ng official sa akin? They refuse to speak to the police officer.